Today we are making acorn squash soup with coconut milk, curry, and a hint of lemongrass and kefir lime. First, we're gonna start with the acorn squash we have here. We're just gonna boil these up. Acorn squash is a winter squash, and it's in the same family as summer squash, but it's actually more nutrient dense. It has a lot of health benefits. It's an immune booster, vitamin C, very high in that, and has a lot of minerals. So we have the acorn squash and just half of an onion. We're gonna sprinkle curry on top. What we're doing here is I use half the acorn that is gonna be roasted, and this part of the acorn is gonna be the bowl. And in the end, nothing is wasted. In the end, you're gonna be able to pour your soup inside, eat your soup, and then after, you can cut open the acorn squash and eat that, and it's gonna be beautifully roasted. So we just added the curry powder, then we're gonna add a pinch of salt, pepper to taste, as always. Flavor is everything. And just a little a little pep in your step. So we're gonna throw this in the oven at 400 degrees for 35 minutes. So while that's in the oven, we're just gonna simmer down our coconut milk. I got a lot of low fat coconut milk. You can get either one, it depends how hardy you're trying to get. And this is lemongrass, two stalks and five leaves of dried kefir lime. Kefir lime is from tropical Asia, it has a lot of health benefits. Lemongrass, it's used in medicinal herbs and for stress relief because of its aromatic flavor and smell. So we're gonna put that in there and we're just gonna have this on a simmer so that the ingredients can infuse. And now I'm gonna come to the I guess cooking in general is fun, but to me, anything with sugar and a little bit of scotch is good for me. So what we have is the acorn squash seeds that I extracted when I was cleaning out the acorns. So that's gonna go in the pan. About a shot of sugar, sugar. Half a tablespoon of cardamom. Cardamom has a really floral flavor and even smell. You can just, the second you open it up, you can smell all of that, it's sensational. And one fourth of a tablespoon of salt. Oh, oil for me? Oh, a little bit. Just a little bit, not too much. So you're gonna put that on the stove for not even five minutes and you're gonna wait till you can hear the pumpkin seeds almost like sizzle up. It's almost like a, 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 a pop. Just keep that on medium heat and you're gonna see all of the ingredients melting in. Our acorn's about to be ready, so we're gonna sift the coconut milk that was infusing in lemongrass and kefir lime. I just have cheesecloth if you have a sifter, that's just fine as well. We're gonna check on our acorn, which is about ready. Oh, super steamy. We're just gonna pop that right into the blender. Pop that in there. We're gonna add the coconut milk now. We're gonna turn the oven off and take out our acorn. Our bowl, it saves some dishes. So, uh, it's an added bonus for me. And we have our soup piping hot. We're gonna pour it straight in there. And now the piece de resistance. Friends come over, 
You're like, oh, it's a decorative ornament. No, surprise. Acorn squash soup with coconut milk curry, a hint of lemongrass and kefir lime. Acorn squash seeds with scotch, sugar, cardamom. Love. Don't forget to subscribe to the Cooking in the Cut channel. And go on cookinginthecut.com for recipes, videos, merchandise, and more.